finally is here. The package I, uh, I was waiting from Holy Performance. So I've been having issues with my 3.5 screen that came with my Sniper E5. It's doing some weird things by by the by itself, like somebody's touching the screen, but nobody's really touching the screen, and it's making changes changes to my setup. So after some back and forth with uh, Holy uh, Holy customer support, where they didn't wanna help me, they say that it was not a problem. That the only solution was to buy another 3.5 screen. Finally, I got a hold of the right person in marketing through Instagram, and they did the right thing. They not not only did the right thing; they upgrade me to the brand new 5-inch screen for the Holy EF5 systems. This screen does everything the 3.5 does, plus much more. It's got gauges, it's got a GPS antenna, so you can uh, you can it can show you your speed if you need to. It's got a micro SD. It connects the same way as the 3.5, so no no modifications necessary. Let's just plug and play. So finally, I'm glad uh, Holly did the right thing. I'm glad marketing department did the right thing, where their customer support didn't want to do anything. So I'm going to install this on the car, hopefully tomorrow or whenever I get a chance. And I'm going to try to mount it in the same place where the 3.5 is. And just looking at the system, I realized that I had this tag form, tag form mount, which is perfect for this, the ball, this ball is the same diameter as that one, so this adapter should fit in there. like that and then this one goes in there this one snug it up and then the sniper comes with two adapters this one a lower profile and a thicker profile so we're gonna use the lower profile and this one just slides in here so this part we mount I'm gonna mount it to the car somewhere under the dash and this screen is just gonna be visible whatever I want it we'll see tomorrow when I get a chance or the weekend We'll see where we mount all this stuff so we can try the new gorgeous 5 inch screen from Holy Performance. Thank you, Holy. Well, here we are watching Vice Grip Garage. We got the holy sniper 5 inch dash temporarily connected to the throttle body for the sniper EFI so we're gonna test it to see if it works before we even start moving stuff around okay that one is on power is on we're gonna turn on the ignition Snap. Here we are.
He says he's got an error not connected to the ECU, so we're gonna figure that out in a few. We'll be right back. Well, I'm done installing the new 5 inch screen from Holly. It's right there. It was pretty much just plug and play. The only thing is that I didn't know is that I had to download a software update for the ECU on the snipers itself so they could talk to each other. Uh, at first it sounded like a big job but uh, after I started looking at videos it was pretty straightforward so I mounted the tack form mount to the side coming down and up it's connected the GPS antennas right here is going over and I got the GPS right here we'll see if all this metal is doesn't affect it if it affects it then I'll move it somewhere else we should be okay so we're gonna start the car see the new screen light up I still haven't put all you can customize it I still gotta figure out how to do it. So it is much better than the old one, than this one. This one is a true touch screen. This one is kind of janky, but it's still it's still good if if that's what comes with the kit. This one is all full color, looks pretty, pretty nice. Two new wizard login settings, five inch LCD, diax, GPS scan. I don't know what that is yet. Look at the ECO of the ECO overview, tuning. You can do all your tuning in here, uh, monitor, a few ratio, timing, speed, map, I think you can add more. Well, we're gonna start the car, see what happens.
car the carpet feels pretty normal after that little drive I'm just trying to figure out how I want this one now they come on the fan the fan one is coming on it's only 185 degrees continue playing with it but like I say it looks pretty good 